which is all self-contained, uh, so that even with the folded stock on here, the upper will still cycle. Hi, I'm Joel with uh, Brad Ells. Today, you've got one of the uh, BRN 180 uppers. We sell these as a complete upper. Uh, and we also have our BRN 180 lowers. Uh, we have two different lowers. This one is our standard BRN 180 lower. We've got a couple of demos here to help replicate the uh, stamped lower receivers on those. Uh, the other lower that we've got available for these are the BRN 180 M lower, which is a more modernized lower. It'll have a more AR-15 stylized look to it. Uh, the uppers are available in uh, 10 and a half, 16, and 18 inch. Uh, we have an adjustable gas system on the 10 and a half inch, and then on the 16 and 18, we have interchangeable piston cups to adjust it for suppressed and non-suppressed use. Uh, the big advantage of the 180 uppers is we're really going after two different crowds there. We've got the, uh, the retro guys who want an AR-180 style build. We also have the uh, tactical crowd where we have uh, a nice upper, which is, which is all self-contained, uh, so that even with the folded stock on here, the upper will still cycle. Uh, you can shoot it while it's folded and then deploy it and still continue shooting it. Uh, with the, both of the lowers, they have a 1913 molded into the back of them, so we can put a, uh, an MCX or MPX style stock on there, any of your 1913 folders. This is an SB 1913. Uh, the, the other advantage of that is this is adjustable for height. So here we have a standard height AR-15 uh, style red dot. Uh, we also have one down here uh, where the stock is a little bit lower and we can use our low mounts for an MRO and still get the correct cheap, uh, cheap placement on them. So the, uh, we have several different configurations. We don't offer anything as a complete rifle right now. But we do have, like I said, the different uppers and different lowers. Uh, Brown is more of an all-apart kind of company.